Hello, my dear friends. I'm Sridharam from Nivedita Academy. Uh, we discussed uh, previous uh, videos about the modal axillary verbs. We discussed about will, shall, and can. Today, now let us discuss about the another modal axillary verb, may. You see, may and uh, may can be used for permission. In the case of permission, I told you already, can and may are both interchangeable. We can use it for asking permission and granting permission. Say, may go to, may, may go home, sir. Yes, you may. You can use, yes, you may, or you can use, use yes, you can also. Can I go home, sir? Yes, you may. Or, yes, I can. Uh, yes, you can. That way you can use, etc. Then it is used for possibility condition also. In the case of possibility condition, it is it shows 75 to 80 percent of certainty. I told you already, will is used for 95 to 99 percent of certainty, and would is used for 90 to 95 percent of certainty, and can is used for 85 to 90 percent of certainty. This may is used for 75 to 80 percent of certainty. You see, he may be at home now. That shows this show the certainty is about 75 to 80 percent. And the inquiry, mostly the offices, customer support, or in the reception counter, or in the police beat in the bus stand, bus stops, uh, you can find these kinds of uh, these kinds of the use of me, these kind of sentences may help you. That shows you can go and ask any help. It's a reception counter, the inquiry, they, they will be giving you any kind of help, whatever else you have in the office. Okay. For that it is used, inquiry. The next one is benediction. Benediction means blessings and wishes. May God bless you. May you live longer. May you live in all prosperity that way. And it is also used for cursing. Cursing means malediction. Cursing. May you go to hell. That way, this may is used for different purposes. Okay. Let us discuss another accelerator in the next video. Thank you very much.